18 yet? No. Hey, Chris, how are you? Well, I'm glad, Brian. All right. Wait a minute, something's wrong. All right, you girls ready? What's going on? Don't you laugh at it! Oh, my God! Well, now, now hang on, Quagmire. There's no guarantee it's your baby. Giggity? Oh, I say that. Chris, could you please get Hannah a thank you basket and schedule her next appointment? I'd like to see her again in two weeks. Of course. Mr. Quagmire can fit in you at 3 o'clock a week from Thursday. That works. And you know to fast the night before? Yep. And would you like to leave your panties in the fishbowl for a chance to win a free lunch? Good luck. When are you going to do that drawing anyway? Oh, there's no drawing. I just like smelling the bowl. Now, Meg, in order to get you into fighting shape, I want you to drink this glass of raw eggs. I don't see any yolks. Just drink it. Peter, wake up. I need to know if I can delete your iCarly's from a DVR. What? Oh, damn it. Wait, I didn't fall asleep first, did I? No, wait, 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 what happened? Wait, wait, wait. Were you asleep? Did I win? I won! Guys, we were all so tired, there's no way to prove which one of you fell asleep first. Oh, uh, yes, there is, Joe. I got cameras in every room of this house. There's a naked lady squatting over a cake in your kitchen. She'll wait. She, she knows to wait. Glenn, would you feed Mittens? Mittens has food in his bowl. That's old food. Mittens, shut up. Mittens, shut up! Don't you talk to Mittens that way! Mittens is a member of this family! Mom, you want this three-way to happen, you're gonna have to change your tone. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain, Glenn Quagmire. Uh, we're looking about a four-and-a-half-hour flight time today. Uh, we got clear skies, good visibility. The temperature in Atlanta is 64 degrees. Uh, the flight's gonna be a little longer than we've expected. Uh, we've got some very strong headwinds, giggity. Uh, flight attendants, please prepare for takeoff. I can't believe Lois would cheat on me. Look, Peter, I know this is a very difficult time for you, but I, I want you to know I'm, I'm here for you if you need anything. You want me to drag my sack across your face? What? Uh, see, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I, it's, I, when, when one of my lady friends is upset, that's how I, that's how I cheer. L listen, Peter, I, I, this is all I know. I'm, I'm not very good in these types of situations. Oh, Dad, I think this is Mr. Quagmire's driveway. Didn't he say it was between two big oak trees? Well, there's a lot of trees around here. How do we know we're in the right spot? Uh, I think it's a safe bet this is the place. Well, this looks comfortable. <sighs> this is gonna be a relaxing weekend.